Okay, so this is how to check if your diverter valve is bad. So this is the bad, the old one off my car, 2004 Audi A4. And this is the new one I got. So if you have a vacuum pump, you can uh, attach, the, attach a piece of hose to the back here. Try to pump vacuum. And it won't hold any vacuum. And if we go to the new one here and try it, you'll see it'll hold vacuum steady, no problem. Now, if you don't have a vacuum pump, um, the other way you can do it is to hold in the spring inside here, just using this extension. So just push it in, put your finger on the, the end here. Hold it, release, nothing. It's, it's not holding. Whereas the new one, if you do the same thing, just push it in the center here, just be gentle. Hold the end, let go, and you hear it snap closed. So if you push it in and hold it, it snaps closed. And that's what you want to happen. So that's how to check your diverter valve. The reason I'm changing mine is because I got a engine code come up and it uh, recommended to check the diverter valve so hopefully this will solve my problem.